I have some good stuff. I'm what? gonna I'm gonna be doing um on the kickoff show. Yeah. Actually. Oh sweet. Yeah, so I'll be doing the kickoff show, so I'm looking forward Let to it. Let me ask you something. As a as a as a performer, as one of the best technical wrestlers in the history of the game. The right? hell, you know, what you finna say, the greatest match wrestling match of all time? The I'm, hell with I already had that. No, no, no. You already no. seen it. I wanna oh, ask you oh, what? if you were <laughs> if you were going into a match and it was billed as the greatest wrestling match ever. Before it happened, you're going into it. Would you like that as a performer? Because I don't know how these guys feel, but I wouldn't like that pressure, right? I don't want, you never want to hear someone say, oh, you got to go see, what's his name tonight? He's the greatest comedian ever, right? Or you got to go to this restaurant tonight. It's the greatest restaurant ever. Because you know what you always say? And Jerry Seinfeld just did this in his new special, but every time someone says it's the greatest ever, you walk out, you go, did that suck to you? It kind of sucked, didn't it? It's yeah. not the greatest yeah. ever. Your expectations are too high. That's my point. Would you like that pressure going into the, a match? Well, this is the thing right here, man. This is the thing. You got Randy Orton. You right. Know, who, who's, Third generation. You know, that man. You know, he's my guy. Uh, and and he, he's, he's one of the best. Yeah. He's one of the best. He sat under the learning tree. So, so I got to give him, you know, his props. He knows what he's doing. Um, and then you got Edge on the other hand, yeah. you know, who's back to uh, finish. You know what I mean? Uh, one Eight thing, year layoff. Yeah, one thing about it, man, you want to you want to walk away from this game the way you want to walk away from it. It's just like Undertaker. We've been talking about the last ride and whatnot. Um, you want to finish this thing the way you want to finish. You want to walk out of this game um, a special kind of way. Uh, that, that's the way, you know. That's the way a lot of these guys, man, are bred. Um, Edge is one of those guys. Edge was a hell of a performer. Um, I wrestled Edge at WrestleMania. Eighteen. Um, yeah, yeah, and um, it, was, it was a good night. It was a good night for me because Edge, Edge is a performer that works at a very, very high level. Um, I think these two guys can go out and bring you to the point to where you say, "Man, this was a really, really good match." Um, one thing about Edge, what's going to be unique about seeing Edge go out and perform if he can pull it off? Um, that that's the that's the question mark. If he can pull it off, you're gonna you're gonna see um, a guy go out and do something that you don't see these guys do today. All right, and that's um, go out and give you certain uh, move set, but his storytelling is going to be something that you go, wow. Okay, this this is so that that's what I'm wondering. Is it gonna be? Is it gonna have that that um, Shawn Michaels, Undertaker, you know, WrestleMania feel in Houston, Texas, um, where you saw the two oldest guys on the card go out um, and perform better than anybody on the card? Uh, you know, are we gonna see something like this? Do we have the right two guys to actually be able to go out there and pull something off like that? I think so. Um, is it going to be the greatest wrestling match of all time? Oh, the hell with that. I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just playing. It's just so much to live up to. It's, it's, Are these two capable of having a classic match? Yeah. Well, just think about uh greatest wrestling match of all time. Then you think about Regan Steamboat and Ric Flair. Yeah. You know, and then you think about Steamboat Savage. You know, you think about, you know. Sean and it, Taker. Sean and Taker. You, you, it, this is a hell of a bill. Um, for for these two guys to be able to go out there and walk that plank and actually be able to get it done, so I'm I'm looking forward to seeing if if they can do it. I'm I'm looking forward to seeing Edge still got some left in the tank. You know what I mean? Uh, is he rolling on fumes and just trying to get to the next gas station? Is it going to be one of those type of? I'm I'm I'm, really, I'm looking forward to finding out um, what's going to happen. Do, is Randy Orton going to go out here and push this guy uh, to the to the brink of exhaustion? And he just have to say please. Please just don't beat me in one of those type of. I don't know. I'm looking forward to it, just like everybody else. But uh, I will be uh, a part of the. Uh